How about one of my other favorites? Translation isn't instant. Yep, that goes along with uh, it not being a conversion. Um, it would be great if we could flip the magic translation switch and have your document translated instantly. Well, we can't do that. It's just machine translation and won't be very good quality. But we're kind of more in the market for professional translation that's going to give you a lot higher quality than machine translation. Well, and I think you know that brings up a couple important points. And one of the ones that I can think of is if you're looking at having something translated and you're trying to imagine in your mind what sort of time would be required, I would ask to think about what it took to create the English. If the English is a 600-page manual that took two months to write, there is no way in hell that the translation <laughs> takes 48 hours. It's, right. just, it's not possible. A good translator can handle about 2,500 words per day, and an editor, six to 8,000 words per day, depending on the complexity. The same goes for the translation. Depends on the complexity. Um, but those are things to think about when you're trying to budget time for a translation job. And if for some reason you have something urgent, you have to talk to your project manager. And there are certainly strategies like adding more translators, removing QA steps. And I say that very carefully because, again, removing QA steps, that means you're, you're potentially removing uh, steps that would prevent errors. So you have to look at the subject matter. If it's something very risky, very technical, I would strongly suggest not doing that. Yeah, and we have a standard workflow for regular projects, and there's a reason we have it. It's the highest quality while still maintaining you know, an adequate timeline. Uh, but when you do want to kind of make one of those steps faster, it's kind of it's a trade-off. So you can, you can add more people, but that's going to drop the timeline. So it's kind of it's a give and take, and you have to realize that too when you're, when you're discussing that with your project manager.